Welcome to Health and Fitness with a new video. The World Health Organization will decide today whether to declare the epidemic an international public health emergency. Chinese officials say 220 people have died. On January 30, 2020, news about the coronavirus outbreak that started in Wuhan, China, is changing rapidly. The respiratory infection, which is closely related to SARS and MERS, has been spreading across China. And cases have been diagnosed in several other countries, including the United States. We'll provide the latest updates on cases, deaths, travel restrictions, and more here. Health officials on Thursday reported the first case of person-to-person -person transmission of the new coronavirus in the United States. The patient is the husband of a woman who was the first reported case in Chicago, officials said at a news briefing. The woman, who is in her 60s, had returned from Wuhan, China, the epicenter of the virus. She was hospitalized but appears to be doing well. The number of cases continues to rise rapidly in China. China said Thursday that the total number of deaths from the coronavirus had risen to 220 with cases now confirmed in every province and region in the country. More than 7,700 people have been sickened in mainland China, while 68 and more cases have been reported around the world. According to the European Center for Disease Prevention and Control, another 1,737 new cases were recorded in the past 24 hours for a total of 9,900 worldwide. According to Chinese officials and the World Health Organization, the real number is likely to be higher. Tibet reported its first confirmed case. This means that all of China's provinces and territories have now been touched by the outbreak. Thailand has reported 14 cases of infection. Japan has 14, Hong Kong and Singapore have 13. Taiwan has 8, Australia, Malaysia and Macau each have 9. South Korea, Germany and the United Arab Emirates each have 16. Canada has 3, Vietnam has 5, and India, the Philippines, Nepal, Cambodia, Sri Lanka and Finland each have 1. Confirming India's first case, the government said the patient, in the southern state of Kerala, was a student at Wuhan University. The rapid spread of the coronavirus has unleashed a wave of panic and, in some cases, outright anti-Chinese sentiment across the globe while the majority of cases center in China, Thailand, Hong Kong, Taiwan, Australia, Macau, Singapore, Japan, South Korea, Malaysia, France, Canada, Vietnam, Nepal, Cambodia and Germany. There have been no deaths outside China. In the U.S., the CDC is reporting five confirmed cases from these states Washington, Illinois, California and Arizona. It had 110 persons under investigation for coronavirus from 26 states. In addition to the five confirmed positive, 32 have tested negative. They are prioritizing the testing based on a person's risk. How many people have been diagnosed with the virus, and how many have died? According to European CDC, the majority of the confirmed cases, more than 75,000 are in China. Another 68 cases are confirmed outside of China in 15 countries. Countries with the most confirmed cases include Thailand with 14 and Taiwan with 9. All reported deaths have been in China and include 16 healthcare workers. Is travel to China safe? Wuhan is closed to travelers. The CDC is advising that travelers avoid non-essential travel to China. Travelers who do go should Avoid contact with sick people Avoid animals, animal markets, and products that come from animals Wash their hands often with soap and water, or use an alcohol-based sanitizer if that's not available Seek medical care right away for a fever, cough, or difficulty breathing Tell a health care professional about any travel if you find this video useful, please press like button and share with your friends too. Watch more video like this, subscribe the channel and press the bell icon. You will be notified when we put a new videos.